All right, what we're gonna do is change the front brakes on the Mustang today. And this is a pretty simple job. Pop that off. This car has a lock lug which uses this little key. Stick that in there on the right spot. Take it off. <laughs> Take off these 11 16th bolt. These are the pins that have slide the caliper on, and we're going to reuse those. Right, when you're prying the caliper off, I find that it's best to go right in the center, push against the rotor. Got the caliper off. I removed the outside brake pad. Then discard that. We we'll take our clamp, push it up against the old brake pad. It should move pretty freely. You want to go until it, until it stops. You're going to need all the room you can in there when you put the new pad on. Set this to the side. Get the old pad. Use my wire brush. Next step, take these old rubbers out. And I do that by grabbing on the end there and twisting. Just like this. So that's the old rubber. I just grab it on the back, twist it. The next step is to knock this cap off of here. Next step, powder pin. Cover. And then there is a one eighth inch nut. This is the time to check your spindle to see if there's any grooves or anything in it. And this one feels great, no grooves. I ordered these Power Stop Evolution brake pads. And they're good stuff. This is the Z23 carbon fiber and ceramic. And they came with a kit. It also has cross drilled and slotted rotors. They have that uh, they tell you which side to go on on the back. Now I bought bearings and a bearing uh, new kit, spindle lock nut kit, a new seal for the back of the rotor. The brakes came with uh, new rubber to put in the calipers and some friction compound. And so the next step we got to do. bearings in. So what we'll do, step number one, spray this guy off real good. Next step, pack our bearings. 
Alright, this is the bearing. We don't need this race. This is already inside of the hub. So we won't be re reusing that. The same thing goes with this front bearing, the outside. And the other side. So what we want to use is a Ford Lincoln Mercury multi-purpose grease. Put a little bit in here. And so what you want to do is you want to pack between this hole, you want to pack the grease in there until it comes out the sides. See the way I'm doing that is I'm putting it in my hand. And I'm rolling it in there. So I'll put my fingers in here until I can spin this. And you'll be able to feel when it gets enough in it. And yeah, I can see I can feel it loosening up. seal here all right we get to use one of my favorite tools this is my hammer his name is Dennis I like to put a little grease on here Set your torque wrench. 18 foot pounds. Then we put our cover on. Secure our collar pin. A little trick for installing these is you got your cap, you find a socket big enough to go around this outside lip. 